Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for checking out this video here on Show Style and Spirit. I am Ebony, of course. And as you can see from the title of this video, we will be taking a look at Letitia Scott's earlier Instagram live from earlier today, where I know that she talks about Destiny, Sunny, and Moses. That was the part that I saw after um, I returned from the movie theater and the cider mill. So that was the part that I saw. So I'm going to go ahead and play it from the beginning. Then I will come back with my commentary. Of course, everything that I'm saying in this video is alleged and just my opinion. And the Copyright Act of 1976 says that my fair use commentary on this Instagram Live is allowed. Please do me a solid and hit the like button, share, and subscribe. I'm going to mute my mic so that you all do not experience an echo. Here we go. Okay. What's doing today? Oh, 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 what you doing out here? I thought you was gonna be at home having fun. Look at my eyes. When I say having fun, bird. Wait, let me put my glasses back on so y'all can't see me. <laughs> y'all listen. One thing about the um Africa we don't always be a sorrow, y'all. Listen, I met this sorrow here. We are wild. Wait, you're you're Alabama A&M too, or just same I am. Sorority. I'm graduating. Same sorority. Same sorority. Yes, I graduated from Alabama A&M. I know that. Yes, yes. But she, what's new? I was Ohio State. Ohio State. She's Ohio State. Ohio State. Ohio State. Ohio State. Ohio State. And y'all know my husband's a Michigan fan, so I'm not supposed to be socialized with her. But what? But as a Michigan fan, it's a Michigan fan. Are you gonna give me the first spam ball? Let's get some first spam ball. We have the apple over here, y'all. Hey, Avery, we're gonna get First spam. Oh, New York. Okay, New York in the house. So, we're actually, we're here with Kim and Reese, y'all, because. Listen, cause you need to get the hospital. I've been telling all the people here in the DR, all of them said they're going to come to visit the hospital because we're like, y'all need to come visit Alabama. Because we're going to be sleeping on Alabama. And I'm like, come on, y'all. What y'all doing today? Ooh, I love South Africa. Me and my friends had so much fun. Me and my friends, what the fuck? Me and my family had so much fun that it was like a history trip for us. We also like a really great celebration. <laughs> Degrees. You're not in a chica, but chicken not in a yo. What's that, Marcel? Oh, 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 o
It's 7 p.m. Friday. It's 95 degrees. I ain't got no nigga. It's no nigga. It's no nigga. I do. Why I got two drinks though? You got two drinks. Why I got two drinks though? I got two drinks. I don't know why I got two drinks. Because I got two drinks. is much needed first of all we just wrapped filming last week and we was like we need a fucking trip so we planned this trip in a week but we was like we need to celebrate our anniversary so we're doing this trip like in a week it's celebrating our anniversary celebrating like just fucking living life because life has been rough right now so your mama said she got some tea for us. My my mama, my mama's supposed to be at home watching my kids. What tea she got for y'all? Cause I want to know what it is. Cause I ain't got no tea. <laughs> she said, "What my mama? What tea my mama said she got for y'all? Your husband from Pontiac. So your husband may know Marcel." Thank you. Happy anniversary. Thank you, guys. So, like, we're really here celebrating our anniversary. Kim and Reed celebrate six years in a week apart. Me and Marcel, we celebrate 18 years of marriage. So, yeah. Thank y'all. Y'all so nice. I love this. I love all the support. <laughs> Win a DR. Win a DR. Um, she said my mom was on the live what my mom? listen I know y'all think I know what my mama be doing but she really supposed to be in high school look Kimmy trying to get my I'm talking to the people they told, they told me my mama said she got some tea and I said what tea my mama got she's gonna be watching my kids what tea? Well, the show is about to start it's 6 o'clock no about I don't think the show coming on tonight it is coming on tonight you got some clips it's coming on yeah it is. some people said it wasn't coming on it's coming on tune in y'all ready to see kimmy act the fucking fool I, I already acted up oh, it's okay and so for you all y'all who be like ew that shit be complaining about the rim <laughs> so when we Listen, go on vacation i'm gonna show, show y'all some bitches in the room i'm gonna show y'all some bitches in the room i took bitches in the room let me tell you something. That I don't care about living shit. with this bitch right here because I'm okay with living Did with this bitch. Did y'all see the bathroom we had to share? Y'all have no idea. The room was a bullshit. You have no idea. It has nothing to do with living with this girl. I've lived with this girl forever. Right, right. That's not the issue. So take what you want, but it's not that. But I'm going to put some pictures on Instagram. You're going to show them how the bathroom was? I'm going to show you what we lived in. I'm gonna show you what we lived in. So stop playing hey, with that's me. better because Mel, because Mel paid for the whole thing. She did. Mel paid for the whole no, thing. No, stop it, Mel. Stop it, Mel. Stop it, Mel. Stop it, Mel. Stop it, Stop it, Stop it, Mel. Yeah. If you was in that fucking room, you'd have left. I wouldn't have been in that fucking room. Right? That's my point. That's my point. If you was in the room, you would It's about the respect. Come on, somebody. It's about the respect. Listen. Because at the end of the day, me and Kim has money show for how many years? Listen. Seven years. And how many years more to go? Oh, yes. <laughs> how many years more to go? Be clear. 
be very stop clear. the lie, girl. Okay, I'm gonna stop my lie. But for real, it wasn't about us sharing a room. If you're gonna share a room with three girls, at least give us a fucking bathroom. Y'all about that? Y'all, we gonna show y'all some pictures of the room because we was not. We ain't bougie. I like, we but we like to have a good time and we like to have a nice space when we go on vacation. I took pictures of the Thank bowl. you. Oh, she's on the show. How are we go? How are the people that's not even cast members get a better room than the cast members? And we're fucking working. When we go on trips, y'all, we work. We're working. Hey, tranquilo, chica loca. He told me to calm down. Tranquilo. She said, wait, we are millionaires. Wait, wait, girl, wait. We're not millionaires after we have to pay 5.5 million for the lawsuit. Ooh, that's, we ain't gonna even talk about the lawsuit. They think. We ain't gonna even talk about the lawsuit. Ooh. We, 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 we have been getting like, people have been sending us stuff about people talking about the lawsuit. Y'all, y'all don't have no idea what y'all talking about. But we'll, 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 we'll let y'all know what the real is. Give the same fucking I'm just saying, nobody's worth it. Believe what you want to believe. God damn it. They might have a goddamn uh, tax attorney on here. <laughs> we don't want to pay taxes. They might have a tax attorney on the live. Positive vibes only. Yeah. She said she found her baby. Y'all so funny. Y'all so funny. Yeah, y'all don't see this came on the show. <laughs> This is where I am. Y'all want me to hate this bitch and I don't. I know. Why y'all want me and Kimmy to be in too? Y'all want me to we, hate we, this we bitch and I don't. Kimmy, we need to fight one good time. We did already. Damn. But no, I ain't It's gone. over. Damn. She it's says a over. rap. She says a rap, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> it's over. She sound <laughs> mouth, mouthy now. I've never been mouthy. I'm not mouthy. I like everybody to get along with my track. Show me how my track right quick. I'm gonna have my Somebody said I'm mouthy now. <laughs> I have never been mouthy. Oh, mouthy when it comes to I'm not mouthy, period. She's mouthy when it comes to stormy. She's mouthy when it comes to, you know what? They said they love Kimmy. Your natural hair is giving you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at y'all. Y'all see me. Y'all see me. Listen, I ain't got no shame. Don't handle oh, me. It's the curls for me. It's the curls. <laughs> Listen, y'all know y'all be hating on me and Tisha. I mean, there's no reason why. Wait, because we like to have a good time. Y'all should just enjoy the show, enjoy whatever whatever y'all are going to get, and just like, let's just have a good time. Man, why can't I love this bitch? And like, like when I don't it's agree, right, I don't like, agree. But she don't agree. She don't agree. Why is that not like okay? If you wasn't sisters, y'all wouldn't be friends. That's not true. <laughs> That's not true. That's not true. Don't <laughs> When Tisha was fucking with me. What did I do? I wasn't fucking with you. I wasn't fucking with you. Why Kimmy on me, y'all? I think Kimmy liked me. Oh, I Tisha liked me. Tisha fucking with me. I wasn't fucking with Kimmy. Y'all, let me tell you. I've been, I've been so shady to Kimmy this season. Oh, fuck. It was tough. Watch, y'all watch, watch second half. I had to give you a little taste of her own medicine. It was tough. That's my. So, Marcel, they said, do you know any Mitchells? Mitchells, Mitchell, they said, do you know any Mitchells, Marcel? Uh, Mitchells? Yeah, no shade. I know Mr. Mitchell, he was my, uh, he was my uh, seventh grade teacher. Mitchells? They said, Marcel, never heard her curse so much. They said, Kimmy, I never heard you curse so much. Okay, Kimmy Lick, Kimmy's beautiful love to curls. Hey, I'm growing my hair back, y'all. They, they didn't want to show it on TV, but listen, this, this is, is my hair. This is natural. Listen, this is my hair okay. going back. And real talk, this is my natural it's hair, too. And it is our new friends. This is our new friends. Look at New York. Look at her hair. Her hair is gorgeous. Look, look, her hair is gorgeous. We're in the Dominican Republic. I'm not from New York, but I'm coming. There you go. There you go. We have met so many new friends here. We love it. We love it. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Don't get it twisted. Don't get it twisted. This is our thing. Listen. 
Y'all know I love T-shirts. Why y'all be hating that I like T-shirts? They said none of y'all are loyal to each other. We are, though. But that's the problem. Y'all don't get it. We are loyal to each other, y'all. We really are. We are. We really are. We really are. We love each other. We love each other, y'all. Right. I wouldn't let that girl die on the railroad track to save my life. She better She better help me. <laughs> what they think is that they think that real people don't ever have arguments and don't ever don't or disagree. Dis disagree. Disagree. They said, "Good vibes." Good vibes. 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 Jay, yeah, this is Jay. Jay. This is Jay over here. Jay, 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 Jay,
Thank you guys. Listen, it's, it's so funny because we've been meeting a lot of fans of the show here. And it's weird because we're like, damn, you know, we're from Alabama. And when we travel, we be knowing a lot of a lot of people be like, hey, we're fans of the show. We like thank y'all for y'all support because without the fans, it would be no show. So thank y'all. Yes, them choice we wanted down. I'm done with these all inclusive resorts. We're just gonna get an Airbnb moving forward. Yeah, Destiny my, Destiny is my girl. And at the end of the day, yes, Destiny is my girl. Period. But people trying to like change the narrative and be like, oh, you know, you're trying to hold this whole situation with Sunny. It is, I'm for what's right. We got London on the If track. Destiny was wrong in the situation, I would call Destiny out. But with Sunny, Sunny, I've been knowing Sunny also, and I think Sunny's a cool person. And I said that from the very beginning. This behavior that she's given is just not, I'm not okay with that because at the end of the day, I don't think Sunny should have so much smoke for Destiny. And I stand on that, I've been standing for a minute. Like, whatever y'all situation is, y'all need to talk that shit out. Don't let Moses feel like he got two females fighting over him because we ain't giving that energy to no nigga. So I think Sonny and Destiny need to figure that shit out. But um, Destiny's my girl, period. Y'all want to join me? Join me. Um, I want you to join, I don't care. Sonny knows she's wrong. The thing is with Sonny is that... <laughs> Sunny and Moses can be a thing. And they're saying they're married. Okay, whatever. But don't be having out the smoke with Destiny. That's my I, that's my whole thing. If y'all go back to when Sunny and Moses first came on, it was like why you got smoke for Destiny? You you got the guy. Leave Destiny out of it. Y'all don't want anything. Moses is single, Sunny is weird. I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I just think <laughs> I don't know. I ain't gonna speak on it no more. It ain't my problem. Are you and Stormy in a good place? That's why I love how you should say this shit. People scared to say. I'm for right, y'all. I I have a lot of good girlfriends, and if it was my girlfriend, and I'm be like, girl, if you got the guy, the only thing, the only thing. Sunny old Destiny was a fucking phone call to be like, hey girl, me and Moses were dating. Or I like Moses. That's all. But Sunny didn't give Destiny that. And then when she came on the show, she had all this smoke for Destiny and calling Destiny a side chick and all that. I'm like, where? Why? 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 That's my only problem. But y'all know I'm not for people talking about people marriage because y'all know me and Marcel have had our issues with people talking about our marriage from season season with one B. Y'all been coming for our marriage, so I'm not for people coming for people marriage, and that's why I would never speak on Sunny and Moses marriage. My, I've said it before. Y'all know my only issue with this. She said she did. Destiny want to answer the phone now. Sunny and Destiny had a relationship. So at the end of the day, you owed her a phone call, a text message, and she didn't answer. Bitch, call her again. I don't know why people hate. Like, at the end of the day, it's just what's right and what's wrong. Destiny is not wrong in this situation. I am enjoying myself. I just want to go live so a little bit because we was enjoying ourselves. So anyway, let me see what y'all talking about. Y'all talk about Sunny and Moses and Destiny. Yeah, what's in the room? I'm gonna walk backwards so y'all can see the room. Honey, my kids are going great in school. School is great, y'all. I got a senior. My son is studying for his ACT. The first time he took the ACT, he scored a 25. So we're trying to get a 30 because 26. my son wants to go, uh, I'm sorry, a 26. We're trying to get a 30 because my son wants to go to University of Michigan and we're trying to get a full scholarship to University of Michigan. Um, This is outside. We have the swim up pool. That's what everybody said, our little private swim up pool. Can y'all see it? 
Mm. Oh, well, I don't know if y'all can see the number. Anyways, <sighs> are you leaving the show? It's been said that Scott's are leaving. What? Thank you, guys. Happy anniversary. So we're celebrating 18 years. Kim and Reese, they're celebrating six years of marriage. I'm walking backwards. Y'all better hope on fall. Yeah, my son, y'all know me and Marcel, we're entrepreneurs. My son was like, I don't want to be an entrepreneur, mom. I want he wanted to be a mechanical engineer. So my son has a 4.6 GPA. He's in advanced classes. And we're trying to score 30 of above on the ACT so we can get some full ride scholarships. <clears throat> <laughs> yes. I can't turn the camera around. I'm walking backwards. <laughs> Why y'all trying to see our room? This ain't for y'all. This for me. This for us. Shit. Why y'all trying to see our room? Y'all ain't here saying. <laughs> Damn, I dropped my voice. Okay. Okay. I'm about to go back outside because I can't. Flip the camera around. Y'all know I'm not on social media like this. I don't know all the stuff I'm doing. I'm trying to open the door though. Is it locked? Oh, it's locked. Whatever. Y'all gonna see this. Okay, y'all have any more questions? I hope y'all enjoyed the show tonight. I don't know if it's coming on tonight or not. I heard it was coming on, then I heard it wasn't shit. I don't know. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support. We're about to, I'm about to go back out here in the pool now. Thank you. Listen, we're trying to get a full ride, girl, because y'all know school is expensive, and all my kids are, like, super smart. They make good grades, and I'm just praying to God that he continues to guide them and lead them and allow them to get full ride scholarships, because that's what mommy wants. Save mommy some money. We don't want no... I had to get loans when I was in school, and I want my kids to get them, so... I don't think the show is on tonight. And it, man, I don't even have on no makeup. What she's talking about? Don't be a hater on here. <laughs> Happy anniversary. Thank y'all. I see some messages in here about my cousin. I'm not going to speak on her. <clears throat> It's not coming on tonight. Maybe because it's well, it's Labor Day weekend, so maybe that's why. But um, it'll be on next weekend. Y'all see this rest of this girl's trip. At the end of the day, it was a lot going on in the girl's trip. But I will give Mel her prop. She put on a good show. Uh, I mean, a good trip. At the end of the day, it was a good trip. I wasn't okay with her friend coming for me, but hey, it is what it is. Um, but it was a good trip at the end of the day. So we had a good time. Oh, girl, I ignore the mean spirit. I under what I've learned been on this show for seven years is that there are just some females that are just completely unhappy in life. So I just have to block them out. But I just wanna say T Squad been holding it down and I appreciate y'all. Much love. I love y'all so. I do girls trip every year. Me and my homegirls from a and we go on the girls trip every year. And we all, we get Airbnbs and we get rooms, but everybody have a good space in their room. So yeah, we do girls trip all the time. Your daughter got over 80K in scholarships and grants. Girl, send me some information on where she applied, what she did, because <clears throat> we're definitely trying to get MJ some scholarships. I know, okay, I got all these T-Squad shirts and I've been trying to figure out how to give them to my fans because I don't want to charge y'all for the shirts. So I think I'm going to put a post up where y'all can just pay for shipping or something like that. Y'all just pay for shipping and y'all give me y'all size and I'm going to see y'all these shirts. So they'll be coming soon. When we go on a trip for, when we're filming a trip, y'all see the cameras up for the trip? Production provide that trip to trip for us because we're working when we go on the trip for the show we're literally working from the time we wake up to the time we go to sleep so if we're working like that just know that production provide those trips for us 
Yes, please come to black. Thank y'all. Listen, y'all come to black. Y'all show out. Y'all show us mad love. Y'all support us. And for that, we're, we're appreciative of that. But if, if there's a time you want to come to black, baby, homecoming 2024 is going to be lit. So y'all pull up. October was October the 12th, 13th, 14th, that weekend. It's going to be lit in Huntsville. So pull up at black. We'll be there. <clears throat> No, production did not choose the room. Y'all saw the show? Y'all saw who chose the room? What you talking about? Stop being messy. You saw who chose the room. You saw the show. That's how I went. I had to tell the lady here last night. She was like, well, is that stuff made? I'm like, no, we don't make shit. We don't make nothing up. What you see for real is what you get. Like, right? it's real. The conversations we have, the stuff y'all see on TV, y'all, y'all, we ain't making this stuff up. It's real. Y'all saw who picked the room. Y'all saw how the rooms went down. It is what it is. Like that's that's what it was. <laughs> okay, what other questions y'all have before I get up off? Get over it, girl. I'm over it. It was a good trip though. Like we listen, it's like you have to make a sacrifice. <laughs> so we sacrificed Billy knows. I had to take medicine every night, every day. My head was hurting like crazy being in those rooms. Every freaking day I had to take a goodie. So, yeah. Hey, girl. Hey. Oh, thank you. Uh oh, oh, they calling me. Yeah, I got to go. I got to go. They calling me. We'll show y'all some, some pictures of the room. You let us know what was so bad about them. We'll put pictures up. <laughs> Did you see the room on the Vegas show? Everybody had a good room. What happened? What? What he do? Look, y'all, Marcel always get in trouble. Look, he always getting in trouble. He always, and they talking about his wife. Thank you guys. Um, thank y'all for y'all support. We're just going to um thank y'all. Y'all have a great Saturday. You can be on Kimmy page. Why are you on my page talking about Kimmy? <laughs> no shade. <laughs> That's what it is. It's a disrespect. You know, all people know that. It's a, it's, that's what I. I don't know what more y'all want me to say. I said it. It's a disres, it's disrespectful to put us in our rooms. You put us in. At the end of the day, man, Kimmy should have not been in those rooms. Period. Oh, so y'all cannot be on my live. This is second destiny because destiny is my girl. So we're not gonna do that. So for that point, we're gonna go ahead and just you know exit, exit y'all off because we're not gonna do that. We can all have disagreements and we can agree to disagree, but we we're adults, so we can speak and talk like adults. We don't have to cuss nobody out. We ain't got to call nobody their name. We're gonna like we're adults. We love Destiny, right? Hey, boo, hey. <laughs> Oh my what you think you should have been in the room? Y'all tell me what y'all think you should have been in the room. Y'all tell me. Y'all got common sense. You tell me what you think, girl. At the end of the day, it's due respect. That's all I'm saying. I wasn't. So, my lie was about. Negativity and positivity. It's a balance. So we're gonna do it all. Y'all got stuff to say to me, so I'm like, I'm gonna answer my friend. I'm gonna answer my my people. My people have questions. I'm gonna answer the questions. So enjoy your vacation. Exactly, people should respect each other. Yeah. I can whatever. That's your opinion on me. I don't care. <laughs> Okay, bye y'all. Y'all have a good rest of the Saturday. Enjoy y'all family. It's Labor Day weekend. Y'all eat some ribs. Enjoy y'all time with y'all fam. So we'll talk to y'all later. I love you too.
Thank you. Listen, Boston, my granddaddy lives in Boston. So I used to go to Boston every other summer to visit my family. So I got a lot of family in Boston. So thank you, Boston, for your support. Love y'all. Yeah. These people are here trying to disrespect my girl. Yes, yeah. not okay. So I'm about to go and get off. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Y'all have a good day. Y'all saying we love teaching. This my mom. I love teaching. Okay, y'all. So that was Tisha's live from earlier today. As you saw, uh, Tisha and Kimmy, they're on vacation right now. They're both celebrating their anniversary. So on August 25th, which is also the day that the singer Aaliyah passed away, August 25th, 2001. But August 25th is Kimmy and Maurice's anniversary. They've been married for six years. So they got married in Miami. August 25th, 2018. So they were filming season one of Love and Marriage Huntsville in 2018. And the show premiered in January, 2019. And um, Marceau and Tisha, they have been married for 18 years. So they were still complaining and happy anniversary to the couples, to both of the Scott couples. Now the ladies are still complaining about the room. Tisha and Kimmy actually said that they took pictures of the room in the bathroom and they plan on sharing them on social media so that the viewers of Love and Marriage Huntsville can see uh, what their complaints were about, I guess, or to try and validate their complaints. And Kimmy was definitely lit. I don't know what is her drink of choice. It looked colorful, like some sort of margarita, perhaps. But she was like kissing and licking on Tisha and saying that, you know, the viewers just want her to not like her. Uh, no, Kimmy, roll the footage, baby. Go back to seasons two and three and four. You told Carlos King at the reunion that if you and Tisha were not related by marriage, you did not see yourself being friends with her. So the viewers, we have a lot of receipts, a lot of reason to believe that, you know, Tisha is not your ideal girlfriend. But um, she was saying, you know, that we're just trying to get her to not like Tisha and that um, people hate on them. You know, that that liquor was definitely giving Kimmy liquid courage. Oh, my gosh. That that was kind of hilarious. Now, um, Tisha claims that people are mistaken concerning um, the latest update with the lawsuit involving them and Zen Gardens. And they didn't give any details, of course. They did not shed any light, but only said that people are mistaken. And when it comes to Destiny, Sonny, and Moses, Tisha said that Destiny is her girl and that she, meaning Tisha, is for what is right. Tisha does not like the smoke that Sonny has for Destiny. And I don't believe that that quote unquote smoke is still there. You know, a, a lot of time, as, as we're watching the show, a lot of time has passed from January of this year when Sonny and Moses were featured on Carlos King's podcast show that kicked off in Huntsville in January. And then, you know, a few months later, they're at um, St. They're in St. Thomas on a girl's trip. So definitely a lot of time has passed. A lot of conversation has been had between Destiny and Moses and Destiny and Sonny. So I don't think that same amount of quote unquote smoke is still present. But that is what Tisha said. Tisha also said that she will not speak on Sonny and Moses's marriage because she does not like it when people do that to her. So... I mean, I guess one could argue her even giving her opinion on the entire triangle is um, speaking on their marriage, but she did not say anything specific, I guess, about their union. She just felt like Sonny had a lot of smoke for destiny. And she said that they should not let Moses feel like he's got two women fighting over him. Now, Tisha also said that, you know, the room was so bad in St. Thomas that she had to take medicine 
And then she said she had to take a goodie each day because of the headaches that she had in the room. So I'm trying to think about reasons why a bedroom would give you headaches. The only thing that I can think of is if it was like really hot inside the room. But I don't, you know, I don't know what any other reason there could be. And it, it seems like they would have had air conditioning. I just doubt that the rest of the house would have been air conditioned except for their room. So I don't think that that was the reason. So I don't know why she would have had headaches. But that is what she said. But I thought that that was interesting. She seemed to be not as like uptight. She seemed to be very relaxed. I believe she's having a good time. The uh, drinks are definitely flowing, okay? Evidenced by Kimmy. So I'm glad that they're on vacation and having a good time. We know that filming has wrapped. Tisha shared that on her IG stories a few days ago. And it wrapped at the vow renewal uh, for Chris and Nell Fletcher. So I thank you all so much for checking out this video. Please hit the like button on this video as it is a free way of supporting the channel. And please subscribe to Show Style and Spirit if you have not already done so. And I saw the movie that's about artificial intelligence, AI. It's called Afraid. And um, this AI is named Aya. And she, honey, is much more deeper than Alexa, okay? She called Alexa out her name. <laughs> she was like negotiating bills for this family, getting their like medical bills lowered. I was like, what in the world? Like, can she do something with like people's mortgages or what? Like this, this artificial intelligence was ridiculous ridiculous okay but i do not want it i don't i don't want a lot of ai i don't want no fake fendi intelligence no um watered down intelligence no thank you i want your standard teacher in a classroom teaching for elementary middle high school and college intelligence that's what i want and I went to the cider mill and um, I was out in the sun, definitely got some vitamin D and I sat by the pond for a minute, but the, duck, the ducks were not in the water. They were on the ground and like the clear people, they were throwing like pieces of their donuts at the ducks. They were, the ducks were scrambling to eat. And then they were like following us humans. So I said, you know what? Let me just get in my car and just go, okay? And I enjoyed my cider slush and I've got like some um, cinnamon donuts in the fridge. But um, yeah, I hope that you all are having a great weekend so far. The plan is to go to the beach tomorrow. That is my plan. I just wanna get up and go before the crowds and crowds and crowds get there. But either way, it's all good. But I will talk with you all soon. Bye.